We're just chugging along with our two a days, and we're inching closer and closer to the start of the football season. Tonight, we're going to turn our attention to the Harris Lake Park Wolves. Harris Lake Park is coming into 2020 with a bit of a chip on their shoulder. They finished eight and one in the regular season, only to lose in the first round of the eight-man state playoffs. That disappointing end of the season is what is now pushing the Wolves in 2020. They've come into practice with a renewed energy to keep up the pace in this new season. That and the fact that they're one of the few teams in the country that's able to play is also fueling them. We weren't sure if we'd have a season here, so we tell the guys all the time, we got to be really thankful for this opportunity that we have because people that are 30 miles north of us in Minnesota aren't getting to play. So uh, we're just going to take advantage of every opportunity we get. We're just happy to be here. We're glad that we get to play. We're really fortunate to be able to play as other teams aren't able to. Just We're just right. We're excited. We're ready to play. The Wolves are working hard, and sure, last year's loss is on their mind, but that's last year. They're focused on this year. They've got a lot of guys coming back, including quarterback and running back, plus some guys on the line. Experience is always important to success, and HLP is hoping that experience pays dividends. Our team is just as good as last year since we got our blockers back pretty much. We really lose a good lineman, but... I think we can make up for it with all our quick guys. We had a really fun and successful year last year, and, and we did lose a couple guys that were huge impact players. But we got a ton of guys with a lot of experience. We bring back really explosive playmakers. We're really excited about that. But it all comes down to the same thing it always does in football is can you block and tackle. The Wolves are hungry, and they want to right some wrongs once this season gets underway. For their first game of the season, the Wolves are going to be on the road, headed south to taking on Newell Fonda. Always a challenging opponent, so that game should be a great way to kick off their season.